Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am sitting here, nasally AF, um, but I just washed my face. I have the perfect amount of sun um, right now coming in and um, the baby's awake. So if you hear the TV going on in the background, just ignore that. Um, I, I definitely have like a couple of things or several things in mind that I've been wanting to record and I want to make sure that I get them up and uploaded before I actually start work, which is this upcoming week. I'm going back into corporate America and I'm very, very excited for this new journey and opportunity, especially as the baby's turning eight months on Monday also. So, um, you know, like I feel like it's time I, um, meditated and kind of like visualized this opportunity for a while so um yeah i'm actually very very excited that it's coming to fruition and um yeah so i definitely just want to sit here and chit chat um i know that i'm in my pjs but i promise you guys i literally just washed my face um i just use this derma e normally this is what i use when i'm not upstairs in my regular bathroom i the products that i'm going to be talking about most of them have been sent to me by the brand and i have zero zero commitment to talk about them one they were all able to fit in this little bag and two um i have been using them now i'm going to say for about three weeks three to four weeks and i've used them long enough that i feel the need that i definitely would like to speak to you guys about them um especially because now life has completely changed since having august who is my son and um you know like uh, putting on a full face of makeup it's just not a priority or it's not not that it's not a priority it's not really feasible um when i first had him i knew i know for sure i wanted to feel like myself so there were maybe like two times that i definitely like went downstairs i asked my wife to like hold him and i said i i need to feel like myself and the way that i felt i thought i needed to feel like myself was by putting on makeup and then I would come upstairs and pick up the baby and the baby's hands would go straight on my face and I would be like, oh no, you know, because obviously like makeup transfers and if it's not clean makeup, then obviously it's getting all over their little hands. So for the last two years, I can say that I have been talking about clean makeup and I had the opportunity to work with a clean beauty brand here in Atlanta for a little bit shy of a year also before giving birth to uh, the baby. And I got to learn a lot of different things about um, products and all that good stuff. So uh, Merit Beauty was has been kind enough to send me several things. Um, I'm going to be completely upfront, honest the makeup brush is a little yanky like you know it's a little gross right now but it's because i've been actually using it <clears throat> so it's been my multi-purpose so um i told you guys i went ahead and i already washed my face i'm gonna go ahead and just kind of like get ready and maybe like talk with you guys i don't know i don't know how i kind of want to do this but I definitely know I wanted to show you guys the products that I have been using and that I actually really like them because they're um, one, multi-purpose and two, um, they're just like creamy and they look good. You know, like I don't have to put on a lot of makeup for Christmas. I'm just going to use a little bit of tea tree oil, but for Christmas, I definitely went ahead and I added a little bit more um i think it was maybe foundation and then concealer but they personally have this stick, multi-stick it's called the minimalist perfecting complexion stick um so it's this multi-stick right here that um can be used as both a concealer and as your foundation and I was like, that's impossible. Like, that's not going to work for me. Like, I love to have a pretty bright under eye. 
and I'm happy with the color that I chose with and it works um so I'll show you guys like how I did it but because it is a little bit lighter I tend to like lighten all of the um center of my face and then with their bronzer is how I deepen the rest of my face and it works everything works so um Chloe's walking around Chloe turned 15 in December she's uh now officially my oldest Yorkie um I don't know if I've spoken about this on here but um if you guys go back to like my oldest videos of my very first first videos let me apply the um great skin this is this is nice it's a nice thin serum um you guys can see it here so you guys can already see look at the and it's not sticky which these this is some of the things that I actually really like about this brand is that, you know, like everything is very multi-purpose. Like that's the only right word and appropriate word that I can use for um, the products that I'm using from them. So if you guys go back, this is their brow pomade or volumizing pomade um, in clear. But if you guys go back to some of my original videos, going back to like 2012, I believe. I always get confused if it was 2012 or 2011 when I started this channel. And um, you would see Ernie. So Ernie was my very first dog since I moved out of my family's house. And he was a Yorkie. While I was pregnant, He, um, we had to put him down. He started to get... You know getting sicker and sicker and sicker and his quality of life was just definitely changing tremendously on top of me being in um <clears throat> i mean I, I took my pregnancy very 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 easy and i feel like it was the only way that i was able to bring um august here and I say very easy, but for me, very easy is still very active. Like, I'm always on the go, go, go. And now, raising the baby and seeing how, like, holy smokes, he is literally just like me. Um, he's super energetic, very, very high pace, like, has so much energy. And I'm like, kid. Like, this is what pretty much my mom had to deal with <laughs> with me and once I grew up uh, once I was a little bit bigger and I lived with my grandmother who's the person that finished or pretty much practically raised me I calmed down a lot and then once my teenage years came around um I obviously like picked back up I was always in a lot of activities and college I was in a lot of activities also so working in retail worked out perfectly for me so um this is their bronze balm in leo i'm just gonna go around yeah the, the outside this is like such a beautiful color this is why i say it's multi-purpose because it just works it just works and i like the shape of I mean, it's sleek. Either way. Like I said, this is not a paid video. I just wanted to show these items to you guys um, to show you like how functional the brand is. And it is considered a clean beauty brand also. Um, I find that their prices can be a little, slightly, slightly, not going to lie, um on the higher price but it's also because i worked for a beauty brand which i remember asking her when i first started working for her you know like why why you know like why do you choose these prices um so low 
and her response literally i i literally look up to her so much like i loved working for them for this beauty brand most of you guys know them um or know that i worked for her i say her as into the owner um but the brand itself and her response was literally the ceo's response was um because she wanted to make sure that there was access for clean beauty to everyone so not just to one demographic over the other one she wanted everyone to be able to afford clean beauty and that right there at first i couldn't comprehend it like it just would not settle in my head and now after having a baby i'm like i don't have money to be spending on myself anymore you know like everything is literally for him okay so this is now um that a minimalist perfecting complexion stick and this is in the color khaki so let me show you guys it's a little bit brighter it's a little bit lighter um no not really because look at it blends right in but i'm gonna show you guys like how it actually how i've been using it and then if you literally want to add some more um then you can go ahead and just add to build i have a cold so that's why you guys can see those marks around my nose so you can add and apply a little bit more to add some more coverage or um, you can go back in and apply some of your personal favorite concealer, which um, that's what I personally did for uh, Christmas because I, you know, I was a little extra, not too, too bad. Um, but what I was saying earlier is pretty much like I don't have... The way that my mind has completely changed <clears throat> in reference to like purchasing beauty products and stuff like that, it's crazy. It literally boggles my mind because I thought not, I didn't think a lot of things would change. And now I notice that even if we go to the mall and stuff like that, I go thinking that I want something for myself and I walk out. Like, I don't need anything, and he needs everything. He needs PJs because if you have kids, you know, like, they grow out of things very, very quickly. So, all right. So, this is my face right now. Um, And I went ahead and I chose this Raspberry Barrett Flush Balm Cheek Color, which I actually, like, truly, truly love this color and i'm not saying that i promise you guys like holy smokes this color is just super pretty and i've applied it on my um on my lips just to give it that tiny bit of like a berry tone um flush of color and it does look super pretty so you can you can see right here Highlighter. Okay, so I feel like I stopped wearing highlighters for a while because, you know, like the the brands, the amount of highlighters that were coming out was just insane. And then I just felt like I have no need for highlighters anymore. Like blushes, I can understand, you know, like you can excuse blushes because there's so many shades that you can actually like apply and they look really good. And then there are highlighters and you're like, okay it's the same color just like what's up but this one here is um the day glow highlighting balm in bounce yep in bounce and this this right here has changed my mind about highlighters this looks so pretty holy smokes it looks just super natural there's seriously just like it i cannot stop talking about this highlighter i dedicated a little reel on tiktok or i dedicated a little tiktok um discussing this and let me see if you can can you see it right there 
Oh my goodness, I truly hope that you guys can see this look. I think you can see it there. I think you can see it there. I think so. I think so. I hope so. Because this highlighter, let, let me just look. And to some people, it's probably like, it's just a highlighter. No, 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 no. I'm telling you, it just gives the perfect amount of glow. Like there's absolutely, can you see that? Please tell me you guys can see it because like I was saying, highlighters for me, they were just overly saturated and it was like, what's, what's the point in even wearing a highlighter anymore if I look like, Okay, so I'm just gonna spray a little bit of setting spray, which is normal. I'll add a tiny bit of powder in my um, T-zone. Um, I'm actually also loving this Patrick Ta foundation. So this is what I've been using, these items that I just showed you here. And then on Christmas day, because I wanted to add a little bit more um, coverage, that's when I went ahead and I used this. This powder here, also bomb in his foundation kit. Uh, they didn't send me this, so I bought this. Um, and I have been enjoying it. The mascara that um, Merit sent me, it's okay. Um, I'm not going to lie, it's okay. It'll, it'll work, it'll do if you don't have anything else. But I just, and I, I think they just recently won, they won something, I can't remember what it was. It's the mascara that it comes with. And like I mentioned, it's okay. It's not, I guess for my lashes, I need a little bit more. Um, I don't know if it's, not volumizing or what but like you can't really well now it's going to work yeah you can see it now normally for me i like something that's a little bit more but i mean maybe if i get a full size sometimes the brush it's what what does it it's what it will do okay and then they sent me their um aperif color but i think it's in my purse or in the baby's backpack so um yeah i don't have it here i have um the color that i personally purchased at the beginning of 2022 and this is in the color slip so i'm gonna apply a little bit of this and then i'm gonna grab a little bit of that blush and this is my look I wish, um, you know, I was going somewhere, which I really should. I have some returns to do at Nordstrom, but I don't think that's today because it's a Friday and nobody's trying to leave the house on a Friday in Atlanta. If you know, you know. So this is my full look. I think it literally, if I was not talking, it took me maybe at most five, seven minutes to complete this maybe less more or less but um this is the look that i literally just finished i thank the merit beauty team so so much for sending over these products i like i mentioned at the beginning of the video i have been enjoying them i have tried them and everything that i showed you guys um is on their website as well as over on sephora.com really made this video because i wanted to share genuine thoughts with you guys um if you could only choose maybe like two to let's say two products from the brand i would tell you guys i have to say three 
okay? So you guys can personally choose what you feel you personally need. I have so many different foundations that, you know, I cannot purchase any at all this year. Like, no matter how good the foundation is, I cannot purchase any foundations. Now, if the brands want to send out the foundations for me to try, I will absolutely do it. But I cannot purchase any foundations. While I was pregnant and last and last year, I probably purchased like 10 foundations. And a chick got to use them because foundations expire. But um, right now, I'm currently loving and enjoying the Merit Beauty, the Minimalist Perfecting Complexion Stick. And this is in the color khaki. You guys saw it how I applied it. It works perfectly with my complexion, whether I go ahead and I apply it all over my face as a foundation, but I've been enjoying just kind of like highlighting the center of my face and then just going around with the concealer using less products, you know. Then I absolutely love this color of blush. You guys saw it too, you know, like how it looks on, even on the lips too. And if I wanted to apply a little bit on my eyelid, I can do that. And the highlighters in the color Bounce, which is the highlighting balm, Day Glow Highlighting Balm in the color Bounce. I specifically can tell you guys that highlighters are coming back with a vengeance. Um, 2023 is definitely going to be all about the highlighters. Rare Beauty, if you're listening, I need to try yours. Um, but this right here is my jam right now. I am obsessing with this and I have not spoken about highlighters maybe for the last like two to three years. Have I tried some? Yes. Have I been obsessing over them? No. So this one is definitely, um, I'm liking because it's a natural looking highlighter, which is different than what the market pretty much had it. Everything was very like boom in your face. And I feel like I was staring away from that. Um, and I feel like even with clean beauty, you like to be very like natural. Um, or maybe that's just me. I don't know. So um, that's pretty much everything in the bag. I had um, the mascara and then a, another lipstick and lip liner in here. And this is the size of my makeup bag. So you guys can see everything that I applied is literally uh, outside of the setting spray and the powder. The makeup all fits right in here. I'm not going to put in the brush because I definitely need to clean it. But um, yeah, even if I did have the brush, everything fits in this. And I mean, I can walk around with this and do a face within like five minutes. So check out the brand if you're interested in trying some clean beauty products i'm not getting paid for any of this but i may make a commission if you go ahead and use my link below thanks again for watching thanks for always joining me and i appreciate the love i'll talk to you guys soon happy new year happy new year happy prosperous new year how could i forget oh my god <laughs> my first video for 2023 and many more to come. Thanks so much. I'll talk to you soon.